feel it right now. Let's just tap on that. And that's just come up. It wasn't there. No, because I knew it was coming up, so I had massive anxiety okay. before. Where's the anxiety? Uh, my throat, my chest, my stomach, everywhere. Okay, even though uh, it's 10 plus. Yeah. It's, yeah, it's off the scale. Even though I've got this massive anxiety in my chest, my I've stomach, my throat. Anxiety in my chest, stomach, and throat. I love mixing up myself anyway. I love mixing up myself anyway. All this anxiety. 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 Anxiety. Anxiety in my chest. Anxiety in my chest. Anxiety in my stomach. Anxiety in my throat. Anxiety in my throat. Anxiety in my throat. All this anxiety. 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 Is it moving at all? A bit. Just a little bit. Yeah. A just, bit. Yeah, just try to get an idea of how quickly you shift. Okay. Okay. All this anxiety. All this anxiety. Okay. And you don't know where it came from. If you do the night gamut, close your eyes. Open your eyes, down left, down right, circle clockwise, anti clockwise. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This anxiety, is this it still anxiety. where would it be now? <sighs> Ten. Ten, okay. It's not really coming down much at all. Oh. Can you, thank you. All this anxiety. All this anxiety. I, I might just go and do some matrix with this pretty quickly. Okay. It's anxiety. 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 Which is the worst of the throat, the chest, and the stomach? It's in my throat now. So that's more than the others. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. It's a bit like croaky. <laughs> so, that's good. <laughs> Even though I've got this feeling in my throat. I've got this feeling, feeling in my throat. I love the next step myself. I love the next step myself. Feeling my throat. Feeling my throat. Feeling my throat. That's the main, more than the chest and the yeah, stomach. Yeah, chest now. That's up at ten though. Feeling my throat. Yeah, feeling my throat. 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 It's feeling my throat. Feeling my throat. What is it feeling my throat? It's gone down a bit. What is the feeling? Is it tight? Is it tight? Can't breathe. Can't breathe. Feels like I can't breathe. Feels like I can't breathe. Yes. It feels like a can't breathe. It feels like I can't breathe. It's feeling in my throat. Feeling in my throat. Feeling in my throat. Feeling in my throat. Tightness in my throat. Tightness in my throat. Feels like I can't breathe. 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 But no. It's come down quite a bit. Okay. Yeah. What would you estimate it to be? About seven six seven. Okay. Remaining tight and it's still tightness in your throat. Yeah? Yes. It feels like I can't breathe. 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 It's tightness in my throat. Tightness in my throat. Feels like I can't breathe. Feels like I can't breathe. Yep. Feels like I can't breathe. Feels like I can't breathe. Okay. Just let you know, all whatever it is, it's in the past. It's over. It's over. It's done with. Okay. Just because it's just, just there in your subconscious. That's the reason it's still bothering you. Doesn't help at all, does it? No. No. It's in the past. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. Something shifted down yeah. a little? Yeah. Gone down. Give me a number now. About a two. About a two now. Yeah. Okay. Stomach, chest, throat. Slight tightness in my chest, but it's, it's, it's okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, I'm just going to, because we don't know where it came from, do we? No. So, I'm okay to go and look. And let's just pre-frame a few things. If we find them, this event, we're going to go in there pretty quickly. There'll be, you know, imagine, it's certainly not in your adult years, so it's going to be pretty early. So what we're going to do is we're going to go into that memory pretty quickly. We're going to freeze whatever's there, or any, every, any kind of green animal that's in there. We'll freeze them. And we're just going to straight away get to that little girl Introduce yourself, we're going to tap on her. Okay. Uh, we'll take her out of the situation altogether, so we're safe if we need to do. But that's what we're going to do. Okay. Is that clear? Yeah. So uh, just knowing that what we're going to do, then, then we can do it really quickly if we find the memory. <clears throat> okay. All right, wonderful. Yeah. Okay, what I want you to do, yeah. you close your eyes and just tune back in. So I didn't want to take all the feeling away completely because I want something to work with, some energy to work with. So just tune back in what it felt like, this feeling in your, in your throat. In your stomach, in your chest. 
Can you feel it a little bit now? Mm. Okay. What's it like in your throat? Describe that. Tight. It's tight in your throat. Mm. Okay. And in your chest, what's that feeling like? Tight. That's tight. Does it have a colour in your chest? No. Just the tightness there. Just tight. Hmm? Just tight. Just tight. And in your stomach? Like it's knots. Like knots in your stomach, yeah. What would the emotion be in your stomach, them knots? Fear. Knots of fear. Does the knots have a, the fear have a colour? Black. It's like black knots of fear in your stomach. Okay, which is the worst of the three feelings? Throat. That's right, okay. Yeah. okay. Do you remember a time when you felt this tightness in your throat? It's not in your stomach. It's tightness in your chest. Do you remember the time you felt this? When I saw one. Okay, no, okay, just stay with me. Put your hand on your heart. Okay. Uh, it's okay. It's okay. Um, you got the picture? No? You see it now? Is it just one fog? Oh, it's okay. It's okay. Do we can't harm you? Just keep breathing to your heart. Into six. And out to six. Can you see that younger you in the picture? Okay. So straight away, what we're going to do, is it just one, one frog on its own? No, they're in a bucket and there's loads of them. No, no, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. No, my brother's going to throw them at me. No, it's okay. Oh, okay, so now you know what it is. Mm -hmm. That's okay. That's all. It's in the past. Just put your hand on your heart. <sighs> hand on your heart. Just breathe into three or four as much as you can. And out again. Into your heart. And out again. A little deeper this time. All you're focusing on is breathing into your heart and nothing else, okay? Okay, so if you just put that picture away, put it behind some curtains and just close it away for now. Into your heart, and out again. Into your heart, and out again. Okay, good, good. So coming down, back in control, okay. Okay, into your heart, and out again. So we know what the memory is. Into your heart. And out again. We're all good to see. Okay. So we need to freeze your brother. We need to stop him doing that, don't we? Mm. Okay. That's what we need to do. Stop him doing that. So that that never happens to you. That's what we're going to do. And you're going to protect that little girl. How old were you? I was about seven. You're about seven. Okay. Wonderful. Okay. Knowing that we can control what, exactly what happens in this memory, and you, and you can, okay? So we're going to go before anything happens. Yeah? Okay, good. Do you feel ready to go in there, to freeze your brother? Yes. And freeze what he's doing? Mm -hmm. Completely? Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's do that. Step into the picture. And the first thing we do, we just freeze him. He's no threat whatsoever. Now, have you done that? Yeah. Okay. Introduce yourself to the seven-year-old. Just say, you know how scared she is. Are you there to help her? You love her. Everything's going to be okay. Okay. Ask her what she's feeling right now. She's petrified. She's petrified. Okay. I tell her you've got this great way of making her feel better. And say she's safe. No, you've got to control everything that happens in this memory. Mm. I tell you, she's got this magic tapping that's going to make her feel really okay. I want you to pick up her hand and say so. Even though she feels petrified, why does she have that feeling? Ask her where she feels the feeling. Is it everywhere? She's just frozen? She's just fear. She's just yeah, completely frozen. Completely frozen. Okay, great. I can pick up her hand and say to her, even though she's petrified, she feels completely frozen. She's a good little girl. It's going to be okay. Remember, she's only seven years old, so talk to her like treat her like a seven-year-old. Okay, just as I tap on you, just tap on her. Feeling petrified. Mm -hmm. And reassure her, tell her it's going to be okay. She's going to be okay. Feeling petrified. Feeling petrified. Okay, wonderful. Good. Keep breathing. Nice deep breaths. Does she like the tapping? Yeah. How is it changing? Is it changing the picture? Does she look different? Yeah, she's okay. Okay, just keep tapping on her. Feeling petrified. And just ask her what she's feeling now. Just keep talking to her and reassuring her. Everything's going to be okay.
was she feeling now? She's still scared? She's not scared. Not scared. Yeah. That's the way she's feeling it in her body, that fear that she was feeling. She's just so frozen. Okay, so pick up her hand again. Say, even though she wants to tell him to stop doing that, but she can't. She's so scared and frozen. She's a good girl. Okay, so just, okay. just again, tap through the points. She wants to tell him. So tell him to stop. How old's your brother? Is he a lot older? No, he's only little. He's only little. Oh, okay. Tune into her again. Talk to her. How is she feeling now? She's okay. She's okay, yeah? Because he didn't mean it. He didn't mean it. Oh, okay. What did she thought before? What did, what did she think before? She thought he was trying to scare her, but he scared himself. He scared himself, didn't he? Do we need to tap a little bit on your brother? Probably. Yeah? How are you doing now? Are you here and now? I'm okay. You okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Good. Okay. How about tapping a little bit on your brother? Look at you, that's in there. Tapping you a little. How old is he? He's only about two, three. Two, three, okay. Three. Okay, just ask him how he's feeling. And just, just, just talk to him and tap on him and say it's okay, you understand that. You didn't realise maybe. He didn't want to upset me. He didn't want to upset you. So it was all around this, this event, yeah? But yeah. my brother hates them as well. My brother hates them as well. as well. Okay. Okay. How are you feeling? Now, give me a source level on how you feel. Oh, a lot better. Give me a number. Three or four. Three or four, okay. Yeah, your hands are warmer now. As well. When people are in shock, the hands are very cold. And the, your hands are warming up now. Yeah. Okay, so about three or four, you feel now? <laughs> So we'll come out for a little bit out of the picture. Okay. So just to test a little bit very gently. Just see where we're at overall with frogs now. Just saying the word, how does that feel? Nowhere near as scary as it did. It's still something there though. That that spikes it a little bit when I say the word frog. A bit. Um, okay. I don't know how I'd be if I saw one. That's sure. Okay. Yeah, that's fine then. Well, okay. What if there was a picture on just a picture of a frog on there now? How would that be? I could probably look at it. You'd look at it? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, but maybe for one, there's no way you could even look at it, is that right? <sighs> probably not, no. I'd, I'd, no probably okay. not. I'd look away. Okay. What I want you to do, I want you to go back into this picture now and see what else we need to do there. Is that okay? Yeah. Okay. So stepping back in, 
back into the memory. Just speak to the seven-year-old. And just ask her what she's feeling now around these frogs. She's still scared of them. She doesn't like them because they move. She doesn't like them because they move. Okay, let, let's... Because they jump. Because they jump. Okay, let's pick up her hand. So even though she doesn't like these frogs because they jump, is that because they're like unpredictable and she doesn't know what's going to happen? Yeah, I don't know where they're going to go, do you? She doesn't know what... Well, speak to her. Is that what she said? Yes. Yeah? Okay. Okay, so pick up her hand. Even though she doesn't like frogs, because they jump, and you don't, she doesn't know where they're going to go. She's okay. She's a good girl. Just, again, just tap on her. It's all to her. What's she afraid of as well? What, what is it about them she feels like? Okay, because they, they jump and they don't, she doesn't know where they're going to go. Is she afraid that like, they're poisonous or? No, slimy. No. Slimy. Oh, okay. 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 Feel that they're slimy. I feel that they're going to jump and that she doesn't know where they're going to go. Okay, just, just keep tapping on them. So it's okay now. And uh, I want you to just get on side a little bit now. And uh, let's see you know, if we can really get over this fear. Even though you might not feel you're over it yourself. But let's see if we can get her to really face up to this. Would that be okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Okay. Let's feel that they're slimy. Fear that they're slimy and they're you don't know where they're going to jump. How's she doing? It's okay. Ask her if she's still feeling that fear. A bit. Just a bit. And where does she feel it now? Ask, ask her where she feels it, not where you feel it. In the throat. In the throat. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, what is it that she's still feeling then? Um, why is she still not feeling this right? Is there something she wants to say? Probably. Just ask her what is it? Is there something that she wants to say? <coughs> you got it? What is it? She doesn't know. She doesn't know what it is? Do you know? No. No? Okay. okay. Even though she's got this feeling in the throat, she's a good little girl. This feeling in the throat, and just tap on her again. She likes to tap in, does she? Makes you feel better. Okay, this feeling in the throat. Feeling in the throat. This feeling in the throat. See if there is anything that she wants to say to you. She loves her little brother. That's what she wants to say. Does she need to say that to him? Okay. Well, let her say that to him. It's okay. She, she forgives him, you know? She loves him. It's okay. She knows he didn't mean to do any harm. She knows how much it scared him as well because of her upset. Okay. Good. Good. So how's the feeling in the throat now? She said all that. She's fine. She's fine though, yeah? Let me go. Okay. Yeah. How about... Could we just take one of the frogs out of there? And how can we make it happy and friendly? And maybe it's got a big smiley face or... How can we make it a really happy, friendly frog? How could we do that? Yeah. What would we do? Ask the, ask, the, ask the little girl. Just ask her. Maybe we could just have a look at one of them. And just tell them they're, they're, they're safe. And this one, you know, make it comical in some way. Maybe you've got little boots on and a little, little like a... Um, glasses on. Them. Glasses on, yeah. It's the toad, yeah. And then they're not slimy, it's just nice and dry and happy. Yeah. Can, you, can she see that? Yeah. How does that feel looking at this fog? Makes her happy. Makes her happy, yeah. Could she go and shake his hand? Because he's like a—is he like a gentleman now? Or how do you see him now? 
Like a granddad. Or like something. like a granddad. Okay, maybe like a wise old man. Yeah. Okay, could she go closer to him? Yes. Okay, well let her do that. Let her go closer to him, and maybe talk to him. And maybe he's got some words of wisdom for her. What would they be? Live your life. Live your life. Is that what he said? Yeah. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. Okay. Okay, how's that feeling though? She's really close to him. Okay. It's okay, yeah? Any fear there at all? Any worry? No. What about you, looking at this, being so close to this fog? I'm okay. Okay, anything there at all? No. Okay. What about if there's more fogs now? What about if they're all little couches, maybe? Okay, I'll yeah? go with that. You can go with that. Just create them however you would like them to be created. You know, it could be like you know, baby fogs with, or you know, doctor fogs. Anything, anything that just what you feel would be right. Mm -hmm. What can you see? What are the various characters you can see there? <coughs> and are they all happy and smiling? They're all happy and they're all playing and happy. Okay, my little families. Yeah. yeah. Is the families or are they just all different characters or? No, they're just all different characters and they've all got their own individualities. Okay. Is there any more messages there for you? Mm. Yeah? Let me just listen to those, mm. what the messages are. seen that your little brother or that lovely little brother yeah. a little seven year old you yeah. when you look at that picture close your eyes just tell me what you feel what's the positive emotions there it's it. everyone's happy everyone's happy mm. yeah okay wonderful okay what's the colour around this picture now pink green pink, pink and green mm. okay this picture of little you brother yourself in that picture all these frogs all these wonderful characters with all this wisdom to give you okay bigger and brighter and it's okay to bring that picture into your mind, though? Yes. Yeah. Imagine bringing that picture, close your eyes, and just imagine that coming into your mind, all through the pathways, sending new messages, breaking them old circuits that said you was afraid of fogs and creating new ones that fogs are full of wisdom and whatever else you can get from them. Mm -hmm. And all through the cells in your body, just picking up, sending the message to other cells in your body that fogs are happy and safe and everything's okay. You don't need to be afraid of them anymore. Every cell tuning into that feeling. All them colours send the message to you, to your body saying it's okay, it's safe now. All the way through your body, every single cell, all the way through. Okay, just put your hand on your heart and take that picture, that wonderful, funny, amusing picture with all of its meanings into your heart. Build it up as powerful as possible and just send this new picture out into the universe. How's that feeling? Okay, so let's just test a little bit. So imagine there's a frog outside the door here. How would that be? I'd look at it differently. Yeah. What if we open the door and it just started jumping in? Mm. And be honest, you know, if there's anything there, just let us know. I wouldn't be anywhere near as scared as I was. I wouldn't freak and run out. Right, okay. So I wouldn't want to go and touch it or anything like that, but I wouldn't okay. freak. You don't want to touch it, but Which is good. you actually want to go and touch this frog, anybody? <laughs> so that, that's kind of normal. <laughs> um, so you see them jumping around here now? You don't need to go and touch it, but it's just jumping around. I'd be alright. I wouldn't want it to come near me, but I would be alright. Okay. But that's, that's a big improvement, believe me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to... Put a picture of it. You might, you might want to move away a little bit from the screen. Um, oh, sorry, it's so, and it will take a second or two to uh, to illuminate. Are you ready? How's that? I don't like the look of them, but I can look at it. <laughs> yeah. I can look at it. I couldn't have done that before. Could you come closer? 
No, it's just a picture. Yeah. I think so. Yeah, yeah but stroke it. There's a bit there, yeah. yeah obviously, this is We can tap on that, we can just revert back to normal EFT with that. What does it make you feel when you go to touch it? It might be slimy, but I, could, I, I would never have gone that close. I'd never, sure. ever, honestly, I would like to look away. Okay. Even, even though I'm worried it might be slimy. I'm not worried it might be slimy. I love this myself anyway. I love this myself. I'm worried it might be slimy. 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 Anything else about that when you look at it? You, what would you about it? Uh, might move. Okay. Worried it might move. 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 Might be slimy. 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 It might move. Slime. Give me a sort of slime on that. Gone down. Okay. Yeah. Can we try again? Can we closer? I'm touching it. Yeah. <laughs> 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 How was that when you touched it? This little. All right, little, but. <laughs> didn't look great, yeah. Yeah. So, so what did you feel then? What, what happened physically when you? Uh, <sighs> I don't know. Um, Relieved, I could just do it. I just, I've never thought in a million years I would be able to do that. Okay. Okay. So, okay, we'll, we'll leave it there. You're happy with that? There's yes. more to do there, yeah? Yeah, but, probably, uh, but that's fantastic. Thanks.